Welcome to this NMP flight video tutorial. This tutorial will look at the flight query. The flight query has the options to select the date and times. They are mandatory unless you're making a query on aircraft ID, IATA ID or registration marks. The date gives the option to select one of the three days where flights are available in the NM tax system and you can select the from and to either directly typing into the field or using the time picker option. The auto refresh will refresh the flight list every two minutes if that is selected. The shift if that is selected will shift the times with each refresh. If it's not selected the times that you originally selected will be maintained. When inputting the AO, there is a history available. There is also an option as you're typing that will look for the possible results. In this case, I'll select one and also I will select a second one. And then if I want, I can combine the AO query with one of the options aerodrome aerodrome set, airspace, point, regulation, or traffic volume and flow. In this case, I'm going to add Heathrow as an option for an aerodrome where I'm looking only for the departure flights. To execute the query, I press on the query button and my flight list is showing. The query has the reset function if you want to clear the form and your results. It's also if you are not needing the form to be shown an option to click on the left and that will close down that form and give more space for the results to be shown. A second click on that left part of the screen reopens the query form if you want to make another query. Thanks for watching.